Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. You guys, I was so excited to get home from work tonight. I had two deliveries waiting for me when I got home. Um, one of them was my Sephora haul. I know I mentioned a re in a recent video that Marc Jacobs Beauty line was going out of business and all of his beauty items were 50% off on Sephora and other makeup outlets. So I did get that order today. It was actually supposed to be here yesterday, but I ended up making it here today. Um, and then I also got my very first BoxyCharm pop-up sale for the month of May order. I have about five orders coming from that sale. The order that I got today was the smallest out of the five, but still a great order that I can't wait to share with you and items that I personally cannot wait to try. So if you're interested in seeing what I got in my BoxyCharm box, then just keep on watching. And if you're interested in seeing what I got in my Sephora box, I'm going to link that video in the description box below and you can click on that and check out the Marc Jacobs beauty items and the couple other items that I got with that as well. So moving on to the BoxyCharm pop-up sale. Now remember, BoxyCharm is a monthly subscription box that you are able to use your membership for once a month for their sales to get high-end beauty and skincare products for a major discount. So the three items that were in this order are, well, the first one is the Kat Von D Go Big or Go Home Lashes in Dramatic. You guys, I have been living for some lashes lately. I used to be just a 100% mascara chick. Like, lashes were okay, but, like, I was all about, like, just some really great mascara. But lately, I have been so into the lashes, and this pair is absolutely gorgeous. This is what they look like. They are dramatic, <laughs> but that's what they say they are, so they didn't disappoint. I will say I'm definitely going to have to trim these bad boys, but that's pretty much the case with any lashes for me. I guess maybe just because of the shape of my eye or how big they are or whatever the case. Um, I always have to trim my lashes, so that's not um, anything out of the ordinary. It does come with the glue. Now, these retail for $20. I believe I paid $12 for them on the BoxyCharm sale. I, somebody correct me if I'm wrong if these were a different price but I think they were $12 so that's almost 50% off which is a great sale price um, I'm definitely going to be wearing these in a video sometime soon I will let you know when I have them on and if you have tried these or you own these or you have tried these in the past give me a comment let me know down below how you liked them how was the glue were they comfortable um, I want to hear your experiences with these lashes. I know that I cannot wait to try them. They're absolutely gorgeous, and I'm probably going to be trying them tomorrow. <laughs> um, so, okay, the next item in this box, I have been eyeing this palette for a long time. If you can hear my kids screaming in the background, I've got two teething babies. My 10-month-old has her first tooth cutting through and my two-year-old is cutting molars and their dad is up there with them so I'm not just ignoring babies crying in the background their dad has got this <laughs> um so okay so moving on um I have been eyeing this palette for the longest time this is the um, Boho Pro Palette from Ofra Cosmetics. If you're not familiar with this palette it retails for $99 big ones. $99 this palette costs. And to be quite honest, it's a cute palette, but I think I bought it more out of curiosity as to why the dang thing costs $100 than like the wow factor of it. Um, the highlight colors in it are absolutely stunning. I mean, it is a beautiful palette, but I mean, it kind of just looks a little ordinary as far as the color story. Um, actually, but I love colors. I love warm, um, neutral tones. So this palette is kind of right up my alley, but more or less, I was curious as to why this bad boy costs $100. If you own this palette or you have owned it in the past, I can't wait to hear what you think about it. I can't wait to give it a try. Look for an upcoming upcoming video either tomorrow or within the next week or so on some looks with this palette. I can't wait to make some videos with it. I have wanted to give it a try and I'm so glad that I finally did. Again, this retails for $100, $99, but $100, whatever. And I was able to pick it up for $24 on the BoxyCharm sale. 
for the pop-up for the month of May. So again, I cannot wait to give that bad boy a try. Now, this last item in my box for the BoxyCharm pop-up sale is from Shella. And this is the How To Brow Custom eyebrow pencil kit. This retails for $78. This shade is in beautiful blonde. And listen, you guys, if there is one thing that I struggle with in my daily makeup routine, it is my eyebrows. And I will tell you why. Naturally, I am a super dark brunette, just a dark flat brown color. Um, I do dye my hair blonde. Obviously, I need to re get it redone like severely at this point, which I'll be doing soon, but um, that's neither here nor there. Um, the problem is, is my eyebrows do not match my hair. My eyebrows are that of like a true blonde. They're super light and super sparse. Like I barely have any eyebrows at all. And of course, you know, everybody, the eyebrows are like a totally an in thing right now. I will say that like my problem is they always come out way too dark. Like I have the hardest time finding the proper shade to look right on me. Some women look absolutely stunning with dark, full, gorgeous eyebrows. But for me, like if it gets too dark and too full looking, it takes away from the rest of my look. Um, so I just have to be really careful. And because of that, I struggle. I struggle to find products that work well for me. I have really high hopes for this. This is what it looks like when you open it. It has a little how to card. It gives you instructions on how to use it in three easy steps. Um, and then we have the pencil, the defining gel or tint, the highlight, and then the, the brush with the spoolie and the brush tip. I can't even, guys, it's been a long day. I worked today, um, but I just like could not wait to film these and get these up. I mean, it's like literally like a kid on Christmas when you've got makeup waiting for you, you know, in boxes when you get home. I'm sure you ladies can relate to that. Um, I'm super excited to give this a try. Like I said, if there is something that you struggle with in your daily makeup routine, I want to know what it is because, hey, we are all makeup artists. I'm a makeup artist. I use makeup to create beautiful art on my face. If you use makeup to create looks, um, then you are a makeup artist. That's all there is to it. I don't need a certificate to tell me that I am a makeup artist. I make beautiful looks with makeup and if you do, then you are a makeup artist as well. But that doesn't mean that there aren't areas that I struggle with. And like I said, I struggle with my brows. Tell me what you struggle with. Maybe something that you struggle with is something that I am an expert with. And maybe we can share some tips. If you have any eyebrow tips for me, please let me know. Leave it in the comments down below. Send your girl a message on Instagram or Facebook. I would love to hear it because I would love to not struggle with them anymore. <laughs> but um, so that is it for this BoxyCharm pop-up box. Again, this is only one order out of five for the month of May. I have a much bigger order that I cannot wait for. That is going to be such a fun video to film. And then I have some other ones that are smaller like this. Um, I'm also going to do my Sephora video right now. So if you want to see all of the Marc Jacob items that I got and the couple of other items that I got that are not Marc Jacobs, then just look for the link in the description box below and go ahead and click on that and I will see you there.